Hello guys, I'm going to make a butter chicken today. So I've got some chicken here, which is I've taken from the thighs of the chicken. Marinated in yogurt, uh, chopped green chili, uh, grated ginger and garlic, some salt, turmeric and some red chili powder. But to keep it aside for half an hour. And other ingredients are like this. Onion I'm going to chop, tomatoes I'm going to chop. Got some lemon, some coriander, some butter, dry red chili and some green chili. On top we will also need some garam masala and of course some oil to fry. First of all I'm going to cook the gravy. So I've got a bit of butter and then a bit of oil as well here. And I'm going to add some dry masala, some berries. Flour and cardamom and some cinnamon stick as well. Just a bit. And add some dry red chilies. I'm going to chop some tomatoes and add once the onions start turning translucent, okay? So, onions are turning light brown, so I'm going to add chopped tomatoes now. Okay. Okay. I'm going to add a bit more salt here. Remember, we already added some salt in the marinade. So I'll add a bit more here and uh, let it cook. For say about five minutes before making a puree of this. I may have to add a little bit of water to say half cup of water. Okay, now this is all cooked. I forgot a couple of ingredients, guys. The most important ones, which gives that creamy consistency to this gravy, that is cashew nuts, a handful, and we will be adding some cream later on. Stuff, yeah. So mix it. Let the cashews also cook for a little bit, and then I can make a puree of this. Now I have to shallow fry this um, chicken, marinated chicken. So I've taken the rest of the butter in this um, and added the chicken pieces to shallow fry them on high heat. And then you have to put these aside and get that onion and tomato puree. To cook again on the flame and then you have to add this chicken to it that's it so i'm passing this onion puree to the seeds so get a smooth gravy like that okay see that's green there. so after doing all that i've got this recipe here yeah? so here we are very creamy gravy is ready tomato onions cashew nuts oh it smells gorgeous usually for that nice orange color you if you use kashmiri red chili powder it gives that color i believe but it all depends on good quality one so if you want more color you can ha add some food color you know the red food color a little bit um, if you're not bothered about the color this is fine i mean when we add rest of the ingredients, chicken and all, color will change a little bit more. Um, let us see. So let it simmer a little bit before adding the chicken. 
Once you add the chicken, you taste it and add if you require any further uh, red chili powder and salt and that's it's done. And the final ingredient, there is a secret ingredient which is tomato ketchup and some fenugreek leaves, dry fenugreek leaves. Now this is cooked, uh, so now I'm going to add chicken and taste it and add uh, salt and chili powder as necessary. That shallow fried chicken. Now, guys, I have added that chicken. Does it not look gorgeous? Beautiful, isn't it? See, so I'm gonna taste now. It requires the chili powder, so I'm adding some. Uh, it looks a little bit watery because I got some water in the chicken, so I'm going to cook it uh, so that water th thickens a little bit. So, I'm going to add the final ingredients which is fenugreek, dry fenugreek uh, powder. It gives a nice taste to it. And the gravy you have to adjust your likeness, yeah? thin or thick gravy. If you want it thinner than this, add a bit more water and cook it for a bit. Or if you want it thick, let it cook so that it will give you consistency. Then other final ingredient is, which is the secret, is the will taste ketchup. Add some ketchup. Then you're gonna serve this with some cream and garnish with coriander. Finally, add some cream as well. little food color to get that little orangish color. See if you got the difference. It's a little bit turned deeper. But you don't really need that. Just to show you I have added it. It's really tasty. I just tasted it. Here we go. I've got some jeera rice to go with the butter chicken. The creamy Tasty butter chicken. Make it, guys. Tell me how it is. Turn out for you. Look, garnish it with 